Mike Fuentes. They all are. Yeah. You, can, you can see it on Amin's face, really. I'm just throwing segments over here. I have had about like four hours total sleep this week. The pre-show was three. Yeah. He got an extra one. I got an extra. Yeah, I just yeah. took a nap. You're only <laughs> covering one of the sports. I know, but you know. But the, he's covering them hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah he is. Hard. I'm going at it as hard as I can. That's right. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's impressive, man. Like what I is Amin's coverage, or like how long it? Well, like what? Oh, fire. we're going to roll right Get through the it, fire baby. alarm. Fire alarm. That's what's impressive. I just want to yeah. say right now. Chris Cody like, has a train to make. The last time it happened, I, w- I stopped and I, I got shook because it sounded like, you know, hey, leave the building, whatever. And everyone's like, don't. Just go through it. They can't hear anyway. And I'm like, the mics can't pick up that loud-ass loudspeaker? <laughs> I'm like, no, no, they can't. And sure enough, we post and everyone's like, what was going on in the background? We could hear all these alerts and stuff. I'm like, yeah, like it's unbelievable that that's not detectable by our microphones but i mean you're not you had a premonition that you're gonna die in a car crash so you're safe anytime we're in here with you we know it's not a real it's just a it's just a drill the more i think about that the more i hate that why because i don't want you to die in a car crash i like you you're a friend of mine i would like you to not die at all actually i'm gonna be 98 years old when it happens like like, i could like you know it doesn't mean it's gonna happen also never getting in a car with you again Damn, we've been in a lot of Ubers together, I mean. We have, man. It, between Denver and Miami, <laughs> you're covering the, the finals in those two places. Is that better than the last couple of times that you've had the finals in different places? Yes, in the sense that, look, the West Coast cities can be whatever city because by the time everything is done, I mean, done, done, we've done our post-game show, we've, all the press conference, whatever, it's like 10 at the latest. So it, nine sometimes, like, you know, if we are in San Francisco, for instance, it would be done by nine. Uh, and so we've got the whole night ahead of it. We could literally have dinner at a reasonable time and, you know, go out after that and, and basically have a good time, not worry. The East Coast cities have been problematic because it's been Cleveland and it's been Boston and they all have like a 2 a.m. last call. So by the time you get out of the arena, because the start time is the same, it's always in the past it's been 9 p.m. Eastern, now it's 8.30 p.m. Eastern. So by the time you get out, it's like 1 a.m., and half the time there's nothing open even. And if there is, they're, they're closing in like 20 minutes or 30 minutes. So uh, having the finals in Miami has been amazing. And also it's killing me slowly. Very cirrhosis. Drive down the street to 11 <laughs> is open 24-7. Dude, man. I, 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 Have you ventured to 11 yet or no? Like during baseball? the finals yeah. or in, in general? No, no. During uh, the finals. No, the finals not yet. Like we've, we've managed to be at places that are open and it's just like, Hey, what are we doing next? I'm like, I have to be up in two hours <laughs> to do this show. Like, that's the point. Like, Dan's like, oh, I could tell, sense it on you. Or the dirty secret is like, this has been me all week long. No, I know. <laughs> He's only he only brought it up this time. This time because this time, like, it's it, starting to catch up with it you. It kicked my ass. Like, I'm like, I'm I'm not hungover, but I am clearly, clearly exhausted because of lack of sleep. And my voice is shot because of too much alcohol. Mm. And also, Mine too. I, I may or may not be drunk right now. Mm. Just going to throw that out there. Me too. If, if it isn't the consequences of your own actions. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> Staring yeah. you right back in the face. <laughs> Let me say something. My actions, I'm going to save this company. Wow. Oh. You guys don't even know. How was the mixer, by the way? The mixer, Who went to the mixer the, mi- here? the mixer popped off. I, I was mean, there. Okay, Juju Charlotte. Was there. Juju was there. Juju was uh, there. Hi, Juju. What's up? Yeah. Hey. hey, hey, hey. <laughs> the long way to return. So yes. four people went return. to the mixer. Oh um, no no no! I'm Carmen saying here. Was, I'm oh, saying in here. Oh, in the studio. In the yes. studio. Yeah. yeah, yeah. No, it was it was it was everything that I wanted it to be. It was well attended, um, but not too well attended. Expensive. Mm. It wasn't that expensive. Not for me. <laughs> well, not, exactly. not for me. Not, not for anyone in here. Yeah. <laughs> not for me. Um, <laughs> was wasn't there. But you didn't. <laughs> I paid for my all my drinks, so it was. It got a little Why? pricey after. Because I'm a real, oh, I'm a Ooh. real guy. You Ooh. feel me? So sh- that again. was a great stop on that speed. Save that right one there. for Monday. <laughs> Saving the butte, goddamn. Save, save that one for Sunday recordings. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, no, look, man, it, it was awesome, and then the like I said, the right people came out, and we have like you know I told the story on the show today about being asked why why hasn't Larry O'Brien made an appearance here? Ah, uh, Lawrence. Yep. yep. So I was like, you know what? Make it happen. We're here. So. so we didn't make it happen because it's not here. No, <laughs> I mean I didn't know I didn't know we only were doing like you know 
whatever we were doing today. So right. Mm. Also, and as I said on the show, also the people who said that to me were also out with me until the mm. wee hours. So I was like, there's no chance. There, I know I gotta wake up. It's my job. Like they're not doing it to do a favor. So maybe next time, maybe game six, we'll do it. Okay. I, yeah, uh, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> I was not able to attend the mixer, but I. Everyone around this office was buzzing about one person Ooh. who attended said mixer. And I don't know if Can't I say the name. I'm not going to say the name, but yeah. there was one person that was there that I was told was in and out very efficient with who this person spoke to, maybe two or three people only and then left, but everyone was buzzing that this person yeah. was there. We had a we had a real mover and shaker of the industry here. Um uh, if you go to a mixer, isn't that like like I feel like no, this is no, like the no. whole idea it's of a, mixer a private is to mixer. network yeah. into yes, networking, yeah. networking yes, Co show content maybe not so much particularly when you know there are different forces at work. I, my thing is always I'm never trying to mess up my friend's money and like these people are all my friends because we all work in the same business or whatever. So I'm glad this person attended. I'm, we're not going to say the name. Were you surprised? Can we can, can we no. give a hint? Can we say it and bleep it? No. No, no. Can you throw no on your mic? No hints. We could say it and no bleep names. it. No, no, no. That way we all react to what it. What about a hint? I have a good hint. No. It was Dolly no. Parton. No. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Dolly was there? Oh. 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 Hot or cold? Okay. She hot or cold? She was there working she 9 was to dead. 5, huh? Hey, Dolly. Ah, That's the way to make a living. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Mike's bag on Dolly Parton's songs. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? Wow. <laughs> Six straight there. Well, that's believe. Were you surprised that this person went? Or did you no, know, like, oh, this is my I, look, my person? This is this is my person. So, uh, and I've known this person for a very long time, like before they arrived at where they are mm -hmm. in in this in the scope of things. Also, um, uh, they they were in the building anyway. They were doing an interview with uh, the Martin twins, who also showed up, by the way. Well, I was talking. So about we can the now Martin people are so oh, that we can oh, say. Oh, that's who you're talking about. That's who you're talking about. So oh, that uh, we can say. Yeah, yeah, we can say the Martin yeah. twins. You've seen the Martin twins. Yeah. Skip Bayless. <laughs> no. Wow! That would be bleep huge. It. Yeah, bleep it. Wow! That would be huge. Wow! I really yeah, I, I told Fox Sports it was me or Skip Bayless, and I here know. I am. They chose poorly. <laughs> they chose, yeah, they chose poorly. They chose poorly. Yeah. Welcome to Mystery Crate, by the way. Oh, hey! hey. hey. You know, where's so the, much. where's the, th oh, the beep. Uh, I'm psyched to be oh, here. We don't yeah, have yeah. The this, thing. this is Charlotte's oh. first. No, that's a dead that mystery. That's a bass. Billy throws out of my. Lap. No, the red thing, the red thing. No, the clock. Oh, the clock? Yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Right? Grab everything but it. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah basically. This is Charlotte's uh, first mystery. Ah, the, wow. initial, the initial voyage for Charlotte. Yeah. yeah. Well. I've always wanted to do mystery crate. Well, here you are. Here That's you really are. exciting. What do you think? Yeah. I feel like I'm inside of a crate. Like yeah. I'm, I'm that's, that's what it's supposed to be. Yeah. 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 yeah, that's it. Yeah. Exactly. You should have gone to the other studio. That was something. That was natural. I know. I feel a little bit like I showed up, you know, for, I'm like the second crop of kids yeah. yep. where the parents have money and yeah. I showed up and I didn't have to go through exactly. what the, the other kids uh, had to go through. So, so uh, yeah. ESPN LA, m at the time I worked there, most of the people were had started at Bristol. You were sounding like Stu right oh now. Oh, boy. Really yeah, he I, I got through it, though. I got through it. He powered through. Yeah, yeah, so did I. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. You did power through. So Do you take vacation? Vacation? No. His life is a vacation, Billy. No, it's not. Mm. No, because like I mean, he's putting I mean, he's the hours. I mean, you know, yeah. you know what I mean? Work, man. You like, gotta take care of yourself. I'm gonna I tell you guys all better the time. care of yourself. Yeah. What definitely. I do last night, for instance, that's work, bro. That's not. No, that's no, not I, that's, yeah. That's yeah. That's what you it's tell people. It, yeah. No, no. I gotta say, I was thoroughly impressed with Amin, the host, the party host. At the yeah. end, he's walking around every table. Everybody got a drink. Everybody got a drink. You, you need wearing? something? You need something? It was. What were you wearing? It feels like yesterday it says you're the host, you should have had a blazer yeah, on. Yeah, the Hugh Hefner yeah. robe. Did you have it? I, I couldn't. I thought we had bathrobes in this. We don't have them. So. Oh, <laughs> we don't have bathrobes there? I wanted to come down those stairs, you know, from where the hot yes, tub is. Yes, a grand yeah. entrance. Yeah. <laughs> that would have been great. Here's a mean, like. <laughs> Hello, welcome. <laughs> There's other patrons there. Like, who is this guy? Like Willy Wonka. <laughs> And then do a somersault. Yeah, barrel, yeah, barrel roll. <laughs> <laughs> this, is a, this is a bit in the making. Like, write this down. Somebody. Uh, uh, no? okay. We won't forget. We won't forget. Yeah. Yeah. Write that down. Did you guys know Timothy Chalamet is playing Willy Wonka what? in like a prequel? Wow. Yeah. Did I ever? Uh, I'm wait, so ready. Wait. Everything Jeremy says about pop culture, I'm like absolutely, and it is all yep. over my TikTok. Yeah, we're on. The, we're we on have clearly have the same page. TikTok Jeez. algorithm. I can tell. <laughs> yeah. 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 Chris Cody, do you have that same algorithm? Three Americas. Sometimes that should have been a white woman. 
sounder if we're being completely honest like that yeah, that's what my been. tiktok algorithm is what so tw- i'm a 22 year old white woman <laughs> that's what my tiktok algorithm <laughs> believes for sure yeah 100 yeah. everything that's on there it's for 22 year old white women yep and i'm here for it yeah huh yeah chris apparently is looking for the sound i'll get it i'll get it in a pump okay. rules Actually, no. That's the one that's thing I'm not in on. Same, I know. That is a massive Look at this. This Th- is that's amazing. That's the massive. <laughs> this out. That's also the one thing we I both don't watch. I think you'd be watch. locked in on that. I love, I Look, love Island UK. Oh, wait a minute. I'm I all about it. that. I'm I, all about that, the British accents. I don't watch Vanderpump Rules, but I have become up to speed on... I've Scandable. read about it. Yeah, on Scandable. I've read every article yeah. about it. So I all feel like I All of my info comes it. from Billy. That's it. Everything Billy said, that's what I know about this. But Billy doesn't even know because he doesn't watch. That's not true. Really? No, that's not true. When did you I, start watching? I actually, like, a month what? and a half. What? Oh, thanks, Chris. What? 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 Charlotte and Jeremy, two peas in a pod. <laughs> yep. So my friend uh, Charlie Kravitz has for years been trying to get me to watch Vanderpump, and I was like, dude, there's like nine seasons, and they're like 20 episode season. Like, that's a that's big a commitment. commitment. Like, I think yeah. this is just a show I'm not going to be involved in. And I've told him this for, like, a year and a half, two years, and he kept saying, like, season one and season two of Vanderpump are so great. So we had a bit of, my wife and I had a bit of a lull in our TV watching habits. So I said, <laughs> you know what? Chris, Chris, sorry, what? sorry to cut you off. Well, I don't know, marriage, had we're same, getting divorced. Chris, yeah. <laughs> Chris and I had the same look at each other. We were like, there's been a lull in our marriage. And yeah. we were like, oh, <laughs> shit. It's over. This is my therapy. So anyway, uh, we, so we started watching like a month and a half ago. I was like, I everybody's talking about this show everybody like this is a big thing in pop culture right now but i don't want to join it 10 seasons in and not know the backstory which is completely a ridiculous line of thinking because i've now committed myself to hundreds of hours of television Billy, watching it's yeah. a it's a subway train you just get on that's what every okay so that's what everybody's <laughs> doing and then other people that i know have started watching it along with me but they're watching from the beginning and the current season at the same time that would confuse the hell out of me so i started going back and I've made it to the beginning of season five now. I'm five seasons in watching it from the beginning. I have five seasons to go. But I know everything that was happening in Scandaval because it was popping up everywhere, Instagram, everywhere. So I know all the clips, everything that happened. Now I'm just figuring out how we get there. It's almost like I'm watching one of those movies that starts with the end. Ooh, I and like then the movie. whole journey Tarantino shows you type. how you yeah. got there. Yeah, mm. uh, Guys, very exciting news. Ooh. We are going to get to something that we've been teasing on Mystery Crate. For so long, we didn't really tease it. We teased it like once, and then we've been just, teasing yeah. it forever. What are you it's talking? Been like we teased it on the main show. We teased it oh, here. Okay. Oh, oh, Jeremy's yeah. New York story next. What? All right, Jeremy, it's your time to shine, buddy. <laughs> we've had what, like three weeks a month? When was the, when, when did you go to it's New York? Yeah, I think it was the the first weekend of May, right? First or the se- first or May. second weekend of okay, May? Okay, so been like three weeks, four, three, four weeks, weeks, somewhere around there. We're gonna get to that story, but before that, there was an incredible game that you told me and Chris Cody about that we're going to play here on Mystery Crate because we've got some pretty famous people in this yeah, room. Yeah, we do. Can you explain to people the game? This is great. So uh, it originates from my younger brother uh, texting me out of the blue. Did you know Chris Cody is on South Plantation High School's notable alumni page, but you are not on Cyberspace? Wow. Which was really nice of him uh, to let me know that I'm not on my high school's page, but Chris is. And so... Is this your younger brother that's also you in a disguise? Correct. Me in disguise. Yes. Yeah, yeah, me in disguise. disguise. Yes. Me as a colonial person. You as a bank robber <laughs> yeah. from the Old West. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh, yeah. <laughs> me, me as a Vampire Weekend fan. The, o- the overalls. Yeah. He, great look. Yeah. He, as, as many things as you'd like to say about him, Billy. Can I give you... I don't know what is the game because I I have a backstory on that if you would like. Well, it. I'd like to hear your backstory. My my game was finding out who in this room Sorry. is on their high school's notable alumni page and who in this room is my not. High so I like have that. You, you think so. high school doesn't you have, you have a Wikipedia, Wikipedia page? Oh, I'm looking. <laughs> yeah, time to go look. <laughs> if not, you can it, just add it yourself. That's turns out Wikipedia. Just about everybody that has a Wikipedia for a school of any kind has a notable alumni page. Yes. So it's time to find out around this room. Wow. Who is on the Notable Alumni page? I'll I mean, start. I am not on the Notable Alumni page. Really? What, what's your high school? Can you say your high school? Should, when I, you I, went? should I give? Should I give them? You know, I have a very like weird relationship with my high school because when I left the Suns, before I left the Suns, I they had a uh, a job opening for athletic director, and I was like, this is perfect, Ooh, right? And it the was prodigal son coming home. Exactly, mm-hmm. and I was like, guys, and and at the, it's a really good, it's a private school, and it's really really good. And I knew that me and like my kid at the time would be able to go to school for free, and it's K through 12. So I'm like, this is awesome. I'm gonna move back to New York, 
get the basketball program up. Yep. Yeah, all that stuff. And I was like, yo, I know what athletic director is. It's basically a fundraising position. Like, yeah, I'm like, look, you want Steve Nash, Grant Hill, Shaquille O'Neal? I got them all. They'll donate stuff. They'll donate money, whatever, whatever, right? And they didn't even call me in for an interview. I got so pissed, man. Really? Who'd they go with? Someone from another school, like in, like, their, politics. Yeah, it was, it was 100% politics. I bet you were on the Notable Alumni page, and then they took you off based off of what no, went down there. Here's a here's the thing. Like, this was 12 years ago. So, at the, the time, I wasn't a Notable yeah. alumni. Now I am, but I'm still not on there, so... <laughs> So, so I am not on my high school's notable alumni page, but somebody familiar with the show is. Ooh. And sandwiched in between Jeff Bezos and Kimbo Slice wow. is rest our very peace, own, yeah, rest in peace, our very own Ron McGill. Yeah. He went to my high school. Yeah. I didn't wow. know that. Yeah, Miami did not Palmetto. know that. When did you learn? What that? high school did you go to? Miami Palmetto Fuck Senior you High. Guys. Yeah. Oh my wow. God. Yeah, this loser went to Killian on the other side of the road. Yeah, and that poor, poor part of town. Not all this can be born in Pinecrest, Mike. No comment. Anyway. When did you find out that Ron McGill went to your high school? Just right now. Just, and, just and, now. Wow. Yeah, just right now. Like, literally <laughs> there, the there's, second. He's probably got, at Palmetto, probably has the best alumni as far as, like... South Florida schools, maybe? I have As far as notoriety yeah. of, Beach like, Beach High people? has a lot. Yeah, we have, yeah, that's true. Do, Do they have, have Bezos, though? Yeah, we have Jeff Bezos. Bezos went to Beach High. Yeah. No. Uh, Jeff yeah. Bezos. I have Tim Hardaway Jr. Yeah. Timmy. I have we, uh, Kimbo Slice, as mentioned. Rest in peace. Uh, Ron McGill. Rest in power. Um... Not, not to Ron McGill. He's very much alive. Um, Katie Fang also went to my high school. Cecil mm. Sapp. Yeah. And Dave Williamson, a stand-up comedian. I mean, Barbara Walters went to Miami Beach High School? There you go. Yeah. Like, th- I think this might be a more famous, I mean, more uh, fun game is who's the most famous person that went to your high Ooh. school. Because, you know, I, I don't think, is anyone, let's just say, is anyone on the notable alumni list at, at their high school? No. We're looking is right now. I, We're going around the not, room. not, Charlotte. What? You're not. No, I, I also had sort of a weird relationship with my high school is also a private school in boston and i was constantly in trouble um <laughs> and like they i was not the fit no there were a lot of really good well, well kids. said like there were, well a lot said. Of kid, there were a lot of kids who were like who've gone on to be yeah. lawyers doctors like that's dude, boring though like so the list of uh, and that's great mm. like i but i think i was like always the on a different path and i think Black i have sheep. stayed on a different a different path um and so everyone on the notable alumni list is like we've got olympic figure skater uh physician surgeon well name some names here what are we doing i i don't really olympic figure skater tenley right. albright oh of course olympic figure oh, skater yeah. surgeon. Wow. tony's wheelhouse yep. yeah uh martha field third u.s supreme court female law wow. clerk and professor no way and guys great content let me tell you. Nuclear guys. engineer <laughs> Leslie Dumont. Yeah, like yeah, I'm not on yeah, there. Let, me, let thank me tell you guys, things have escalated. Because I just discovered that my high school, one of the notable alums, is none other than the man uh, who doesn't know anything, who hasn't said anything. No way. Yes. No. Mike Greenberg went to my <gasps> high school. Really? I'm so wow. glad no we played way. this game. I'm staggered. I am staggered because I'm looking because I knew Yasmin Bleeth went there from uh, Baywatch. <laughs> that was that when I was in school. I remember everyone saying like, "Yo, you know she went here." I'm like, "No way!" <laughs> that was like the big thing in school was Yasmin Bleeth went to our school, and then uh, I know that Malcolm X's daughter went to our school because she came back and she, she spoke to us. I think at a at some sort of function. What year was Greeny? Does it say? Uh, I mean, his like, alumnus. Uh, I don't know. You know, yeah, well, he's 55 mind. years old according to Google. Who cares? Oh, yeah, who cares? Class of. That's what just, I thought. Just, Honestly, just really, that's see, what I thought. Like, who cares? Just to, no, see, the just difference. to see the difference. Where Amin graduated, oh, where he graduated. Like probably, he's probably like 10 plus years. Okay. It's like 10 or 11 years before me. So, But, dude, I mean, like, this is, wow. Of the, the Mike Greenberg, huh? Mm, of the notable alumni on, on my high school, it, it's mostly a lot of recent, like, undrafted football players <laughs> who have played on practice squads. Okay. That's most of it. And uh, But outside of that, do you guys remember Don't Taze Me, Bro? Yeah. Oh. My high school. Wow. Oh. Pretty incredible path from my high school Ooh, to UF and yelling, one. don't tase me, bro. Uh, wow. Also, Amanda Plummer, who was uh, in Pulp Fiction, the person who says, any of you mother bleepers move and I'll execute every last one. She went to my high school. Wow. Her, her, name, was hu- her name was Honey Bunny. Come on. Honey, Honey Bunny. Bunny. You got to put her name. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's pretty I have, I have a pretty notable uh, alumni section where it's broken down in athletics and then wow. miscellaneous wow of which i am not a part oh. of that's it it's just athletics or anything else it's yeah athletics or miscellaneous Let's welcome go. to high school buddy yeah we've got uh alex gonzalez former mlb player Aegon. which not one? the one who made the error 
for the benefit the of the Marlins. The one who played for the the, uh, the Blue Jays, the Cubs, the oh, Expos, yeah, the Padres, one, yeah. the Tampa Bay Rays, and the Phillies. Well, the other one's from Venezuela. Yeah. I oh, think. True. Um, basketball, we got Raja. Went to kill him. Oh, 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 if I you stand Stevie up. Stevie Blake. Went to Killian. Okay. Ricky Wait, Blanton. Hold on. I thought Steve Blake went to Miami City. He was high. he was at Killian for a couple years. And transferred. And then transferred Broke. to Miami High. Broke. And then uh, Alex Starling, who was an absolute monster. Mm. I um not that anyone's asked me. Thrill but Hill, I'll, by the way, at Killian. I'll bring it oh, over. Randall? But there's one yes. But there's one that hold on, Billy, because this one's important. Miscellaneous. We get down to everything miscellaneous. Andy Slater. Yeah. Slater mm. scoops. Scooping it. Saw him Miami saw him in a hockey game. Yeah. Also, Chuck Todd. Oh. If that matters. Oh, know. boy. TV? Yeah, TV okay. guy. I'm, I'm not on it, though. Puya the rapper is. Puya the rapper? Nobody? The rapper? Camilla Cabello I think the moral of the story here is we need someone in, whether it's in this room or the other room, to make sure we're getting on all these Wikipedia pages. Well, that I Get was just going to say, yeah. and I don't want to ruin the story, but I had this conversation once with Chris on air, and at the time I was on my school's notable alumni. I have since been removed wow. from there. Really? And I believe then listeners added Chris on to his. Correct. So now, as a result of doing this, all of you will probably be added to your high school's notable alumni hmm. page if the listeners find out who it is, because you can go in and add things. Right. Now, I think what happened is... I was at oh, Mike Fuentes is adding himself to his high school Atta page. Boy. I think what happened was is one of my friends put me on my school's notable alumni page and sent it to me and said, "Hey, look, you made the list because they were just just joshing me, uh, right?" And then me. when I drew attention to it, the school realized it and then removed me. Why? From, well, why do some research, you? man. That's I don't, wild. I don't have the exact answer as to why it is that I was removed because my school has a separate page for notable alumni. Like it links them to a page of notable alumni because that's what happens when Perez notable Hilton school. goes to your school. Right. You know? No way. Yeah, Perez Hilton went to my school. Dude. Uh, Marcelo Hernandez, who's now yeah. on SNL, went to my high school. He's very funny. Wow. Yeah. Well, weird don't ask no Tony no one goes to doesn't think that, so. That's not my take. That's Lewis's take. Let me ask you guys something. Don't do that weird Fidel that Castro went to my high school. No one. Wow. What now? And his brother. Well, yeah. when the it was school in Cuba, was in Cuba, was in Cuba and then, and then when they Fidel moved, Castro. They moved the school. When he took over so in power. So he didn't physically go to your school. No, well, okay, well, he didn't go to yeah 127th Street. He didn't go to that one. That's what I'm saying. No, this is what happened. He he went to the high school. And then he decided to come back and take over the island yeah. and then took over the high school and made it a military base and like his palace. Yeah. So his high school was then taken over. And, and then, then they said, you know what, like all the priests and stuff left and then reformed the school here in I Miami. Think, I think Billy won this, this wow. game. <laughs> Easily. Uh, I, don't know. I did, though, just yeah. find out <laughs> that uh, Billy Bush of the Access Hollywood tape went to my college. Wow. So Not so the same game, though. So different <laughs> game. Sorry. <laughs> let, me, let, me, uh, let me ask you guys a question. You know what's sad though? Wait, right before we change really quick, because because um, Jeremy mentioned it. You know what's sad though is that like they're in because there's different sections and one of them is entertainers and athletes. And right now, so like Nick Martinez, who now plays for the Padres, went there and it says here Texas Rangers, so they need to update this. But <laughs> he's, he, he was playing good. He went, yeah, he is. So he went there, right? But to like Jeremy's point, like I remember other players who were top prospects on this list. Yeah, and then it seems as though. Since that since. didn't pan out, it was decided that they were no oh, longer. Oh, that feels mean. That's, that's adding brutal. insult to injury. Why would you do that? Let them stay on a list that's, on the internet. I'm thinking that too. You're that not hurts. paying for the space. But ours are yeah. ours are a bunch of those guys. Like ours are a bunch of guys who were either undrafted or late round draft picks who might have had a couple of years and mm -hmm. like eventually might get removed. I don't think that they should because they had an impact on the school while they were there, what, you know, going to state championships, oh, no. things like that. that but that's our, not, that's not what, that's not what it is. Yeah. It's notable, notable alumni well, now. It's Although ours is, ours is also, it's Nico Marley, who was a former Ooh. middle linebacker and the grandson of Bob Marley. That's my high school. Oh, wow. It's also about what can you do for the school and how involved are you? Yeah. And yep. like, are they, like, are they getting enough. any juice out? And like, no, I'm clearly not. I don't know if Brett Cooper, the football player, is giving a lot of Coop. juice to Miami Killian Senior High School. Uh, I went to Miami Nolan, and this tells you a lot about the school that I went to. Uh, we got Antonio Brown. Yeah, AB. So, wow. So, wow. Like, here's I mean, thing. he's notable. He's is, super notable. Is it he's possible? Notable. Like, Because as we're talking, I'm realizing – Every high school has someone notable. Is there a high school out there in America where it's like, yeah, no one <laughs> ever like, heard Honestly, there has to be. There yeah. has to be. There has, has to be, be some small well, I'm telling you right now, nowhere. Miami Palmetto Senior High, Michael Fuentes has just been added. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. 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 Can we get a uh, fanfare? This is awesome right here. That's great. Uh, but, uh, yeah, this is working out yeah, fantastic. Yeah, no, it's there. 
Okay. I'm, I'm looking it up right now. <laughs> Notable alumni. Right, I'm wow. right in between Cecil Sapp and Kimbo Slice. There's a oh, wow, good spot for Roll, you. Roll, Roll and Molly. Roll and Molly sliced your way in there, huh? Jeez Louise. Yeah, there it is. How dare you. Michael Fuentes. Congratulations. Everybody's going to know because your name isn't linked to anything else. It's just yeah, it's all in black. That's the same deal with Chris. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's just a link that leads to nowhere. That's fine. So we did the high school alumni thing, and I think we want to go around and see like who has the top <laughs> alumni. But I want to go back to something Billy said in main show this week that I found that made me like kind of sad. Even though I, f I feel the same way, and he was talking with Stugatz about concerts and how he doesn't want, he doesn't want the performer to have the crowd sing oh, to them. Yeah. Right. And then Billy turned it into this like, you know, what was me bullshit about how That's I don't feel, angst. yeah, I don't feel like I'll ever make something no, that is as knows. powerful as that. He says he knows he'll. Yeah, never he do knows it. he won't. And Billy, He's right? Well, I know I won't. Dude, That's listen, a fact. I, no, I no, saw no. you get no. groped at Moss on a sea of people. Hell yeah. And yeah, like well, they were, you were well, crowd surfing. That's a pretty surfing. negative connotation. Yeah, yeah. 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 Like they they were on fondled. They yeah. groped fondled better. Yeah, yeah. Like yeah, he was better. getting he was getting passed mm. around. He was crowd surfing. Oh. So Jesus so there were yeah, hands no. all over him. <laughs> there were hands all over him. Okay, this is getting dark. So yeah. so Billy was crowd You're surfing. Correct. That's okay. So that was can I just that was not the intent. But I didn't plan on that. But see, but you're already doing it. Like you just don't see it. Like yeah, you're not on like the Rolling Stone scale. But like you're Shoot. touching people more you than mean, you think. You mean yeah. a lot to a lot of people. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, physically and emotionally. I like yeah. the idea of Billy sure. saying, "If it's not stadium status, then it doesn't." Exactly. Count. <laughs> <laughs> I know he's like. If they're not singing back to me. Yeah. It doesn't count. Yeah, <laughs> that's what it is. I, they need to say something back to me. Yeah. You I know, do. you could you could have an interactive podcast, which is a phone call. If you think about it, I love talking <laughs> to callers. We, you know, that's one of and I need to talk quietly mm -hmm. because brass is here, but. Mm -hmm. That's one of the things that I don't understand about the building of the studio is there's no phone lines here. So we can't interact with callers as it stands right now. By the way, do you guys know, because we're talking about callers, <laughs> Zoom, Zoom, I have, yeah, so I started, louder, didn't he? <laughs> I started doing on, uh, I don't even know where it is. There's too many podcasts, but a thing called Zoom, Zoom, Stupidity. where I, I, what I was doing was because <laughs> we don't have phones, we were doing it on Zoom. I was just tweeting out the Zoom link and anyone could join. And there's a waiting room, so I would let them in, right? Except yeah, you did that during a mystery crate. I did. Okay, yeah. so yeah, sent yeah. out yeah. a mystery yeah. crate. There's a couple. Okay, there's it was a just three or four of us. There's in that a couple of things. Closet. I did that. I did that two or three times successfully. Then Zoom updated itself, and you had to re-click a thing where you had to like create a waiting room, which I didn't know. So then I did it once where everyone was just coming right in, and I was oh. like, "We need to end this and start again because this is madness." There was yeah, like eighty yeah, yeah. people in the thing, and I couldn't control who was coming in, who was going out. And then there was a day that we were scheduled to do it. And then right before they asked, hey, can you do mystery care with us? I said, absolutely. So I had a two Zoom situation going on. And I accidentally tweeted out the invitation to Mystery Crate <laughs> as the other one. Mm. So then they got bombarded with a bunch of people trying to join Mystery Crate that was supposed to be on Zoom Zoom that I was doing recording on the other thing. And you guys wrapped too quickly because we had a guy that got in on yours and then got in on ours. And we were sending him back to yours to ask you questions. And we were just kind of try to go back and forth and do podcasts at the same Cross time. Talk. Yeah, but you guys had wrapped, so we couldn't do that. Because but by the time that we were ending, you had tw tweeted out the link. So we had like maybe 10 minutes left. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, all these random people started coming into the Zoom. We were like, oh, what's happening? And then I, I went on your Twitter, and I saw that you had tweeted out our link. And I was like, oh, damn. Well, every, t every time, or like I'd say – 70% of the time that I do it, it's like there's space in between. So it seems like we forget what it is that's going on. And I always get a call from like the IT guy freaking out. And one time I got a call from Bimmel. I said like, hey, did you do this on purpose? You tweeted out a Leon. I'm like, no, no, like we're doing a like a segment. But the IT people freak out and don't love this because they get notifications like unusual activity in your Zoom. 85 people have joined your Zoom. <laughs> like, like what is like going on? Like we're getting hacked. Yeah, yeah. So then I I now have like to write them emails like explaining like, hey, just a heads up, you're gonna get, you know, increased activity just on tell our Zoom. Zoom, Zoom just buddy, so that's you know. it. My, yeah. My favorite thing Billy's doing right now is he's speaking quietly as if no one like. Because the brass yeah. is in town. Yeah. Can't yeah. Hear if you talk oh, you're new to Mr. Cream. Whenever we have yeah. to whisper, yeah. we just whisper. Yeah, we just just whisper. Yeah. Before, we can't hear us. Well, I don't yeah. know because we're okay. We're, we're in this <laughs> new studio, and I don't know how it works because sometimes we go out there, and they know everything we talked about, yeah. and other times you go out there, and you're like, how did X, Y, Z go? And they're like, what are you I don't about? know. We didn't hear it. Right? So I don't know. Cynthia's been sending us messages about what's going on, so they're definitely listening. Okay, so – oh, no. That's exactly what I was going to say. Back in the day, you could just cross the hall uh. and, like, very, like, covertly just turn off the speaker so they couldn't hear what <laughs> you were talking about. So you could talk about 
anything. Right. And then no one listens to Mystery Crate, so we got away with it. Right. Hey, well, people what are we talking about? You guys listen to Mystery Crate. It's just other people in here yeah. mm-hmm. sometimes have busy lives and don't listen to Mr. Crate. So we'd say Mike Fuentes, who produces Mr. Crate, just got up and walked out and left. Like he's done I think for the he's day. That shows how many people oh. listen. To he added oh. himself to I the notable alumni off. page, Look, he's and then he's off gone the, uh, covertly. Oh, the microphones. He no, he's gonna covertly turn off the volume oh. of the TV oh. so that nobody can hear us oh. talking. Oh. Look, there's Mo. Mo the Kills here. Just kind of hey, sneaking Mo. around, grabbing. He's hey, coming Mo. back in now. We can hear him opening. Oh, he stole the remote. Oh, he did it. Wow. He did it. Back at full volume, Guys, say anything baby. now. Anything you yeah. want anything. at any volume. Do it as loud well. as possible. Wow. <laughs> we did it, huh? Yeah, good us? job. Good job, everybody. We did it. So what do we want to talk about then? I don't know. What were we talking about child? before we got Hold to on. Zoom? Is there a child out there? Zion Williamson. Whoa. Oh, whoa. Okay. Let's go. Speaking of children. There's a child. Juju. Oh. Juju off the top Potential rope. children. Hmm. I mean, after you. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> what? <laughs> the ball's in your court now, buddy. So uh, Zion is in a little bit of uh, hot water as uh, he announced the arrival or the impending arrival of his first child. But apparently that announcement angered his, um, side his, chick? his, yeah, his action on the side who decided to go public very public. Very public. And uh, the action on the side apparently has a career in the... Um, in the arts. The arts. Uh, the darts of... A the, notable of love, course, some would the say. The adult arts. Yeah. 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 And that's why I said darts, by the way. <laughs> adult arts, darts. Which is a totally valid career. Uh, Correct. Yes. Totally valid career. Yeah. And also, totally valid, yeah. I have... Pay your taxes. Wi- yeah. I have witnessed her at work. And huh. she's... Oh. She's... She's we're, just, works. we're not shaming. Oh, she has talent? No, I no, no. I want to be clear. We're right. not. Yeah, yeah. We're just explaining. We're explaining. I'm going to tell you right, 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 right now. I am not ashamed. Mitch Nobody sh- on this we're just money. making okay. sure <laughs> that people know yes. kind of where we're going. Just I think they get it. I think they get it. somewhere yeah, else yeah, in the yeah. card. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I mean, were you studying for this segment last year during the NBA postgame show that you did? No, that was different. That was different research. That was a little different research. I mean, but it is funny. Like, it would happen at this time of year. Well, guess I'm doing research again, boys and girls. <laughs> you're, taking, you're taking the dive for us. Well, right? so, you so, research? Okay, so I didn't need to do the research, by the way. I, there was <laughs> institutional <laughs> knowledge. Right? Like, I was like, yeah. the Mariah Mills? <laughs> so what has happened? What is the Market. has there been fallout? Is there She's, yes, because she is very openly like airing all sorts of laundry uh, with a lot of graphic kind of description. A lot of um, screenshots of text messages, too. Screenshots. Oh, I'm Those seeing them now. Good. Oh, yeah. there's oh, Snapchat no. messages. The Snapchat, oh, this, because this genius yeah. thought, like, Jeez. oh. It'll go they away. They disappear. Oh, yeah, <laughs> and, and, yes, and by the way, my Snapchat account is Zion Williamson. It's not like <laughs> oh. Z2O or whatever. Like just like. just And it's not even Zion Williamson, one word. It's Z- capital Zion, yeah. capital Williamson. <laughs> she was funny. Yeah, she was like, I can't believe you got her pregnant. And you kissed her? <laughs> yeah, like, <laughs> like, wait, what? I mean, wow. Oh, well, that's there. just crossing so, the line. So, that's 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 a level of intimacy. There's a tweet wow. that she had where she describes very graphically like their their intimacy, including um, <laughs> the fact that he spit in her mouth. Hmm. Yeah, the market. And uh, Alrighty. The yeah. joke. The joke I made. Just so you know, I unmuted the TV. Well, I should say so. the, yeah. the joke. Oh. The joke made in our group chat was. He spit Mountain Dew Code Red, <laughs> and I mean, that's that's the part. Like, so the, we will fat shame. We're not for sure. When it comes to Zion, one hundred percent. One hundred percent. I won't. No. You go I, ahead. I, I w- look. Let me tell you something. That year he, he he didn't play was the greatest year of NBA radio I've ever done. <laughs> <laughs> we went All been th- downhill from there. We went through. <laughs> yeah, we went through. Uh, like teammates that he played with in New Orleans and started making like puns. So like he, he played with this guy named Zylon Cheatham, and we said no. Zylon Cheatham on his diet. <laughs> Dude, I, it was like it was. Do we have a wheel? You can use it for this now. <laughs> oh my God! It Do was, we have a what? A wheel or something? Oh, uh, we gotta yeah, get, out we, hey, look, get out of it. Hey, look, you guys decided to get here. I've been, I've been sitting on all this stuff. Start with notable alumni, and here we are. I have Sean Taylor as one of my notable. notable wow. Alumni. Rest in power. Yeah, rest in power. Hmm. This is all because we turned off the volume of the TV. Yeah, that's what yeah. happened. Good job, I think Mike. Mike. Turned it back on. People got too comfortable with the whole. Let's so just Taylor say Swift. <laughs> Thank you, Charlotte. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, okay. I can buy on that one. Uh, Three America. I uh, <laughs> for the video audience, I'm using. This. What is that? Yeah, what oh, is that I mean, thing? That's a good question. That yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Is also what I was wondering. I have one of those. 
that same in model? Brooklyn. Amin is using slightly different. It's a piece of plastic that you can use to like massage your own back or get knots out, mm. and it is a godsend. It is the greatest thing I've ever spent yep. money on. Yes, hands I, down. I feel the same. I way. saw you walk in, and I meant to be like, yes, but mine is bright blue. I I feel the exact same way. It's Good the best color. twenty bucks I've ever spent on Amazon. This thing is amazing. I call it Genesis. I was just gonna ask Charlotte if she experienced no, Genesis. She Genesis was it. here on Wednesday. No, Genesis. what is Genesis? That it's a person. Well, Genesis it's a basically it's uses a lifestyle. her feet <laughs> to break down your entire body. It's <gasps> called mashing. You yeah, it's called mashing. You I leave that? you leave your body, you had your a soul leaves. You have yeah, and oh, with a migraine that must it be terrible. It would have yeah, been, yeah, been, yeah, been, yeah, been, yeah, been exploded out of the time. You had a mic. You had a migraine on Wednesday. No, yesterday. Oh. Dude, there was a point where oh, I don't know. Genesis was working on me, and she said, all right, now look at the door. And then she started, like, mashing a certain point, and I felt all the blood and all the pain in my body rush to just the right side of my face. Oh, my God. Ooh. I was, I, I don't, like, I was concerned that you guys could hear me just screaming. <laughs> There's no point in trying to be tough. There's no point in just trying to take it. Like, it hurts, but you feel great afterwards. Man, let me know next time. I'm sore the next around. day. I'll fly down Mike. from New York just for that. I yeah. mean, I'm kind of scared. What, you know what that thing reminds me of? What's that? You remember when you used to put the uh, the thing on the wheel of the car so yep. people wouldn't the steal club? Your, the club? I, th yeah. I thought that's what that was. It does look like the club. <laughs> Same man Sims. Billy I asked don't. how I got it through security. Let me tell you something. This, no problems. This, <laughs> this thing gets me stopped at security every single time. Stop it. Every single why time. Why don't you just do you play you it? it? I, that's what I ended up doing. I just leave it here. Yeah. The fact that you're traveling back and forth with the slidey thing is one of the funnier <laughs> things I've ever heard. Yeah. In case you, like, <laughs> need so it funny. in the so airport. Like, <laughs> you should do that through the airport. Like, walk yeah. up with it. Right. Through security. Like, hey, no, go. I like the idea of, like, <laughs> hey, the, the pilot doing? coming out <laughs> saying there's, like, a 40-minute delay, and you're like, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> If you have different when they tones. don't let you when they don't I, let you walk through security. Yeah, you do, do, you that? do that. Like, do you have like a sad Ooh. one and then a happy one? That's a sad one. That's a sad you check a bag, then, you're three pounds over. Like, oh, you're over. <laughs> but but then here, here's the other part of it. Like guys, we have a tailwind. We're actually getting in a little early. Uh, <laughs> that one feels like something going in. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's just upbeat. It's a. <laughs> now nah, now nah, that's nah, that's a good one. That's that's the highest level you yep. can get. Can you play a song on that thing? Let me try it. Name a song. Um, hot Cross Buns. Yep. Ooh, Hot Cross Buns. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> no. <it's laughs> Close. No. <laughs> <laughs> it feels like it's very Nailed one note. It. <laughs> you know, you know really instruments one. like that and the harmonica, people who can actually oh. play songs on them, like if I could play the harmonica, I would be a thousand times cooler and I would bring it everywhere. You know, I'm yeah. going to hard network out you. <laughs> Yeah. On that, because you totally blew clock. right through the clock. Sorry. <laughs> so. Clock management. Charlotte. I forget that Mr. Great still has a clock. Yeah. Joe Mazzula. Yeah, Joe Mazzula. Yeah, yeah. Okay, relax. Jesus. Man. Jesus. Man. Too soon. You guys know who you're Too talking soon. to? Jesus. You know, you know what I thought about last right, night? Too far. Like, <laughs> the, uh, the, the Nuggets won three quarters, so that's, of course, they, yeah. they won the game. <laughs> All right, Charlotte, since it's your first time on Mystery Crate and you're really starting to get into the show, you've been on the show a couple of times, you had something the other day where you like lifted your arms in like a champion yeah. kind of thing. What was it? I don't remember the joke. It was today. It was today? I okay. had a good joke and I went, I raised oh. my... It, what's the bridge, bridge, what's the bridge, bridge, bridge joke? joke? The bridge joke yeah, was quality. Bridge. I Thank like you. that joke. Thank so you. like you're, you're getting, you know, inundated now into the show, but we were kind of messing around with some of the sounds we have back here on the soundboard and on this stream deck here. Inundated. And like, there's a lot of things that you don't have any idea about. Yeah. Because you were not a regular listener to the show before you got on Sorry. here, right? Is that offensive? No, it's not offensive. My it's wife just... doesn't listen to the show ever. Okay. She doesn't like, so don't. I, I mean, I've seen, like, I saw a bunch of clips. I, I had an idea <laughs> of it. I just wasn't listening to the whole extent of where, like, you know what every sound is. Right. And, you know, let's go through our library here and like play sounds for Charlotte and then explain them to her. Mike's going to control did it. You, I have no idea what we're looking did at. Did you think that like you were going to offend us by saying like I didn't listen to like, like how mm, dare you? I No, <laughs> I just have avoided talking about it because I, you know, I mean, I like did my research, you know, I'd listened to stuff. I knew what I was in for, this but I didn't want to You be knew that hijinks like, ensued. Yeah, but oh, I, and, okay. and I like that because I feel like that's sort of my vibe right. also, but right. I, yeah. I didn't want to, I didn't want to also, I don't know, I feel like 
people care so much about the show. I also didn't want to insult. I don't want to insult listeners by being like I wasn't. Yeah. They'll, they'll be insulted yeah, anyway. Like, oh, oh, I've been listening to the show yeah. for no, 15 like, years, well, yeah. and they no, get this this, yeah. this Charlotte yeah. Wilder yeah. on. Yeah, yeah. I didn't want to open yeah. up yeah. that yeah. mystery yeah. crate. We're gonna we're gonna get this moving. I would say that we're a lot. <laughs> so and now that you've been here, you have kind of cut on to that. So like, don't worry about it. Do you, so how is this game going to work? Are you just going to play it and explain it? Or do you want to play it and have her guess I, I what think, you think it is? Ooh, that's a good guess. Yeah, I think, I think what I'll do is I'll play it. We'll have Charlotte take a quick guess. And, and then, then we'll, we'll have somebody explain it. Yeah. OK, before before all of that, I'm I only going to do like five because otherwise I'll be here for half an hour. No, we've got to we got to play at least. 10. No, I want to hear. I want to hear. At least. Well, yeah, what I was going to say is we're going to talk about how we're going to do it. We're going to get to Jeremy's story. Actually, I like that. Yeah, we'll get to it. We got to get to Jeremy's story about New York. He also has a top five list that I want to get to, too, that he says is blasphemous. So I'm very interested in that. But we have to play at least 10 sounds here. So just start picking some. We're going to go really fast. OK, we're going to go with Billy's favorite first. He dropped I, a dookie. That that's dropped a dookie. Uh, you guys have been saying that the whole show. Yeah. What? So what do you think it means? Wait, what do you think it means? <laughs> that like someone that really show. bombed. <laughs> like someone did a bad job. It's actually good guess. It's a good guess. guess. Yeah. It's totally wrong though. Yeah. What yeah. is yeah. it? Okay, thanks. Wrong. It's actually a great thing. Yeah. Really? When, when a dookie bomb gets so dropped. Much. It is like, oh my god, I can't believe it. it usually so has you to use do it after someone says something. No, it's not no. specific, specific, specific to Billy. It's, it's oh, an, yeah. okay. Oh, so uh, this is what happened. Yeah. The Guardian every year puts out their list of top ten NFL analysts. Two years ago, I was number six on the list of NFL analysts. Damn, dude. Thanks. Yeah. It was totally serious. So hmm. they put me on the list. So then Stugat said we should do this on Stupidity, and then. Well, your I nickname said, was the Duke. Well, that's when my nickname became the Duke because that's obviously the football is called the Duke. So yeah. I said I need a football nickname. So it became the Duke. So then <laughs> when I came on, they made this sound and then turned the football Duke into like pooping. And then it's just farting and pooping. Well, it's because and of a Woj bomb, noises. right? That's that's yeah. Yeah. Okay, it's a bomb. Bomb. So, oh. so now when okay. Billy so would okay. do it, a dookie it was a dookie bomb. bomb. Yeah. And then it was like, OK, fine. And then it just gets played. All the Constantly, time, and yeah. I kind of hate it, especially yeah. during football. So season. they do it a lot. No, anytime I talk, That's it gets played <laughs> a lot. And, then and the because next they know you hate it, they play it more. A hundred percent. And right. then the next <laughs> year, I was it. like, okay, well, whatever. I was number six. The next year, then I was number five, and I was like, okay, great. So this is going to continue yeah, yeah, on yeah. for a while. David Sampson number nine one year. I think he was last year's <laughs> number nine. Yeah, <laughs> which I didn't look. This is a serious list that yeah, I'm a part of. What are we doing putting David Sanson on there? You know yeah. what I wanted to do during hockey season, but I didn't do because I didn't do the serious hockey reporting only last night? <laughs> is I wanted to refer to myself because I would Get say like hockey things and they're like, oh, the Duke said blah, blah, blah. I wanted to call myself when talking about hockey, Lord Duke. Wow. Yeah. That's good. Lord yeah. Duke. Lord right. Duke. That's yeah. Really, Lord Change Duke. it to Lord for Lord Stanley. Right, that's that. That's the joke. I that's like it. Christ <laughs> Almighty! Yeah. Oh, wow. So Charlotte, very important. We'll play it one more time so everybody can hear, it so you can really listen to that oh, last okay. fart. And that yeah. way, and that way, Billy gets to hear it too. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> and you have to say at the end, he dropped a dookie. <laughs> he dropped a dookie. You, you have to over say it. He dropped a dookie. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah he he said no, play it so she could hear the fart next? at the end, and then he I goes, heard, he dropped a dookie. I heard yeah, the what's, fart. What's, I. You got. You got. I do think you got the fart in the middle, which is the best one. That's awful. That's like. That's like an offensive okay. part, okay. the yeah. one in the yeah. middle. <laughs> like, it makes me uncomfortable. It's not really a part if you want me to be honest. Yeah. Boy, Dan That's was past the part. There's, there's spray everywhere. Stop everywhere. it. Stop. Can we play another song? All right, next one. All right, next one. Dan would be pissed, man. <laughs> Shockator! What do you think? What do you think he's saying? saying first of yeah. all, yeah, first of all, I what do you think he's saying? saying? I think he's saying shockular. Yeah. Play it again. Play it again. Wow. Play it again. Good, Good job. Exactly <laughs> as intended. Shockier. Is that like when you're like, oh, shocking? No. no. So this <laughs> like one, again, great, great guess. Shockier. Great guess. Great guess. Absolutely wrong. So though. what this is is Greg Cody <laughs> tends to just play defense against the show at all times. So this is Dan's dad, Poppy, saying show killer. And it oh. usually gets played when with Greg Cody when oh. he just says something you know, that's says something very that's, bad. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Uh, okay, moving on. We're going to get lightning around this. Ready? Uh, Light splash. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Uh, I mean, is it like... One more time. Okay, can you recognize Splash. The, can you recognize the voice? Yeah, do you know the voice? Do it again. Play it again. Splash. Oh, come on. Football guy. Mo- There's a hint. Football guy. He's a coach. Yeah. Uh, His name's Mike Tomlin. So. Splash. Mike Tomlin. It's Mike Tomlin. Ah, <laughs> good, good job. job. Yeah, good yeah, job. Yeah, good job. Yeah, yeah, thank you. It was on the tip of your tongue. Yeah, I saw yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. know, here's the thing, though. Knowing this crowd, someone could have said that, but it wasn't the actual coach, and could then I could have said it, and it would have been wrong. Everybody thinks it's me. We would have been like, everybody does. Yeah, good guess, but... 
Um, you fool. Okay, so my initial thought was like, great. Well, see, all, all the things, I'm realizing I'm much more positive than the things that are, I'm like, great point, like, good job, someone nailed it, like, splash, like, buckets. That's not what's happening here. No, no. Buckets. There's Is it like you fell into a pool? No, there's no. actually uh, not real context for it. Yeah, it's so the simplest one you're going to get the, today. At the yeah. end of, well, like, on Mondays or Tuesdays, I, I used to do this thing called the Useless Sound used Montage, to. where I do a montage, and it's just of useless things that coaches and, and primarily That's quarterbacks That's what got you on the say, list, by the way. Right? That is true. That That's is what, what got, got you on the list. list. So it's just a montage of just nonsense, nose to the grindstone, keep chopping, keep the blinders on, stuff like that, just bang, 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 right after, one after another. And then there was oh, – Mike Tomlin is incredible at this. Oh, he yeah. says lots of things. I Don't blink. He cut off his eyelids one week. Like, <laughs> yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. get out of the stadium alive is a recurring thing that he yeah. says. Survive in advance. Um, so then he has things that Jim he calls Obama. splash plays. So then he had a week that he had like seven splashes. So then we just save the sound of splash. And now if someone happens to say splash – his splash. splash just gets yeah. played So right it's after. literally any time yeah. anyone says the splash. word that is yeah. being played. Splash. Okay. But it's just that word. Awesome. But now you know if you want to play like Levitard Show Bingo moving yeah. forward when you're here. What's the word, though? You can yeah. say so splash. So one more time. What's the word that has to be said? Splash. Splash. You, you, you can't go. say yeah. it in the word. You just got to say it naturally. You know what, I'm, you yeah. know what I'm realizing? Splash. Splash. What's that we have mean? a ridiculous show, man. <laughs> that's why we're a lot. That's like, yeah, no, it's, but it's not. But it's like it makes sense to me. Like I feel like a first the first few times I went on, people would be like, "Are you okay? Like, do you get it? I know it's a lot." And I I was just like, "Yeah, I don't know why everyone so could like it makes it it makes a concerning amount of sense to me." Yeah, <laughs> except the the noise. Well, sounds. then you also have, the like, exactly. you also have like people coming like, "Are you fine?" And then you're like, "Yeah, I think so." And then you're like, "But am I?" Am everyone kept asking me. They're like, "Are you are you okay? Are you doing like?" So and I'm it? like, "Am I messing up? Like, is that?" Am I totally blowing it? Like, I, everyone keep. I thought it was I, doing well. They didn't want to tell you, but. Uh, <laughs> oh, no, okay. Yeah. All right, one Next more. Next sound. No, no, not, not one more. This is actually this is actually one of my we're favorites. Running out of time. We're, we're this this is actually one of my more. favorites. We're running out of time here. Uh, Stugach was right. Mm. Holy. <laughs> Stugach was right. It feels. I mean, it's Poppy saying Stugatz was right. Correct. Mm. So yeah. it's anytime Stugatz happens to be right. Like yeah, 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 yeah. Now we're cooking with gas, All right, baby. Five more. Five more. All right, one more. Oh. Right, here we go. We're, I don't know why you keep saying one more. She knows this. Play it one more time. Yeah, like wah, wah. Like downer, like. Right. Right. So w what is this sound played for? Yeah. It's very specific. Like someone brings down the mood. Uh, you're in the ballpark. Well, so I don't know about the ballpark. Not exactly up to bat. Yeah. Not in the right sport. Yeah, maybe. You got a hockey stick in a baseball stadium. <laughs> <laughs> Taking a half of it. Well, you're in the stadium, so. Yeah, 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 okay, yeah. Uh, some, play it again. When someone goes to a sad circus, you play this. It's when someone makes a sad joke. Here's a hint. A it's when a bad yeah. joke, okay, not a sad okay. joke, a bad, yeah, a bad joke. joke. Bad joke. That's what I mean. It's like when you're wah, wah. I yeah. got it right. Come on, guys. Yeah. Mike, I mean, Mike, I mean, you played that sound. We might as well play this sound as well. There you go. <laughs> What's that? And who is that? There's no way. <laughs> <She's> <laughs> I actually, way. earlier in Friday's show, I called for it by the name of this person. So if you were listening in the midst of our no craziness, chance. you oh, might oh, have yep. the name of this person. No. <laughs> mm, you're so close. I was going to say Boris Johnson, but that's what uh, no, that's not right. you got <laughs> said. No. Close, though. Former Prime Minister. Not the former yeah. Prime Minister of England. I don't know. Who, who haircut, said yeah. it? It's uh, Hakeem that's Nicks. Hakeem Nix laughing. Yeah, I would not have very, that. An interview from a long time ago. Yeah. Yeah. It was an interview that really had nothing. Except, 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 except for that. Except for that. And then they just Is that when someone makes a like decent joke? Yes. A good joke. Yeah, okay. good it, joke. it is when that's Mike Ryan decides joke. that it's bestowed upon someone they should okay. get the hundred. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh, yeah. Why didn't I get that from my bridge joke? That's like the greatest thing I've ever done in my career. Because Mike Ryan wasn't here. You did. I called for it. That's what happened. Is I went Hakeem Nix and he played it underneath like 10 seconds later. It's usually really low and you can't hear it yet. All right. One more. And one more. Okay, so this, this is a good one. Yo, chicken thigh. Oh. See, now you're going to have to fade out of the sound because that's that long bed. No, leave no, it. no, let it play. No, those are chicken wings flapping. Okay, but, but why? About what? <laughs> the chicken flew the coop. Mm, yeah. The cat's out of the bag. The horse left the <laughs> barn, baby. <laughs> Uh, what, Charlotte, uh, yeah. Charlotte yeah. has a go-to. He's ending every sentence with baby. <laughs> baby. <laughs> baby. If I say baby, I don't know. Baby. Baby. I don't know. I have time, absolutely no idea what this could possibly mean. There's, there's no way you can. It's, so, uh, I mean, go ahead. The Kentucky fraud chickens. Yes. So anytime oh, no. Stugatz is saying something that is clearly a lie, yeah. they'll hit that sounder, and then everyone in the room will start to sound like a chicken. Bark, 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 bark. Like, what? There's no chance you could have done it. <laughs> <laughs> you don't sound like this because all the chickens are Oh, that's what that is? Yeah, that's what that is. That is 
she's been, a I feel like that's happened while I've been in the room, yeah, and I haven't even. Has, I, yeah. I, I, in the sound I think chickens. half the time I'm in here, I'm just like blacked out, and I'm like, I don't know oh, yeah. really. So but I'm mean. like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> not for the same reason. Hey, I'm give me that. Uh, uh, <laughs> By the way, Taylor sneakily has a great suggestion for most famous alumni in, from in your high show? school. Yeah. <laughs> you want to know who it is? Flo from Progressive went to his high school. No way. That's wow. I think big. he wins the game. That's Dude. big. Yeah. Uh, better than Greeny? Better than Jeff yeah. Bezos? Better than Tenley Albright? Flo's bigger than Greeny, what? right? You don't think? Oh, yeah, 100%. Uh, I don't think so. I, I don't know anything. I haven't talked to anybody. Jeremy, your story? I like how the well, chicken is still flapping in the back. No. Nah. There it is. 